Napoleon was a golden retriever who sort of wandered onto campus some, about sometime in 1945 or so. And I think there was a family that sort of looked out after him, but, but he essentially was given free reign on the campus, and probably because my theory is, I don't know if it's for a fact, but you know, golden retrievers are really nice dogs and these are very good with people. So he was just, he just wandered around campus and had the free reign of everything. And he would show up in classes, he would show up at graduation, he would show up at football games, and just wherever he wanted to go, you know, and everybody just sort of gave him courted him special attention and honor, and he, and he went into, um, you know, he was considered the mascot of the campus, and so he was here for about 15 years, and one, one day, in the wintertime, one year, he was, all of a sudden they realized that they hadn't seen him around, you know, and so uh, he was discovered died. This was in 1960, I think he died. Uh, probably from exposure during the winter. You know, they found him under, under the porch in some house. So they, they then had this, um, I call it a funeral, but it's really just a burial ceremony for him. You know. President, there's, I got a picture of President Doudna, probably using that one, President Doudna. And uh, the groundskeeper, his name is Camille Monier. He's kind of standing there with the shovel. He just dug, dug a uh, grave, you know, and they just buried Napoleon. And now, of course, they've got that you know, monument on the flush with ground that tells a little bit about the story of Napoleon. But if you look in the Eastern News, Eastern News Index and look up Napoleon, there's hundreds of articles about it. Because almost every time you turn around, somebody's written something about Napoleon. <laughs> and I've got you know, quite a few pictures of him. I've got pictures of him getting his shots one time. And then they featured him in the Warbler. One of the Warblers is dedicated to him. And they have an embossed image of him on the cover of it. So he was quite a, quite a character and quite a feature on campus 